So I suppose it's very handy that you can actually work from the boat being internet people. Yes, definitely. And what, what makes a difference as well is because we started living on the boat last year already, last summer. So I was working uh, on the boat from home, from the boat, uh, while Jorma was still working. So, But I've got my contacts now, I've got like, quite a lot of work, I've got some projects. So I've, I've eased it off a little bit now that we're going, but when we're ready again, maybe in a few months, I can pick it up and hopefully there'll still be work. You never know, of course, but at least I know I can do it. I know there is work out there and uh, if need be, we can just stop somewhere in the marina for months if we wanted to. Yeah. Yeah. We so you've got the same the story with your work now? Yeah, I've started to link into some contacts for remote testing and IT work and that sort of thing and uh, at the moment I'm recovering from having worked for the last eight or nine years straight without a break practically. But uh, I'll probably get bored pretty quickly. I need to keep my brain going and I'll dive back into that stuff and see how that goes. All right. At the moment I've got engine woes to worry about so I'll focus on that first. <laughs> so <clears throat> You used to live in normal accommodation, and now you live in very restricted space accommodation. How do you feel? How do, you, do you miss this, the, 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 the loads of space of a normal house? Not really, no. no we we went thought it would be big, didn't we? Yeah, but, but actually it's been really, really We did easy. it in phases as well. We, yes. we, we moved from the Finca to a flat in Gibraltar. One and bedroom flat. Yeah, yeah, so that was a big culture change down from that. And But it was layered as well. And we went from Finca to... 45 square meters, got rid of a lot of our crap, which was great and liberating. And uh, then the next layer down was to the boat. So we were in the flat for about a year and then we moved onto the boat. And that was the next layer down and we got rid of the rest of the crap and we reduced it to one berth of, yeah. of junk. We still had quite a bit when we moved on. We had yeah. the two berths there, not 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 full to the to the ceiling, but quite full of shit. I'm a bit of a hoarder. But then we had some people staying, so we had to clear the one bird. So you go through it again. We did get some storage in the end. First we thought, let's just see if we can just get rid of everything. But we we did get uh, what is it? One two square, square two square, two square meters, meters two by one. in Manilva. So we've got a TV some winter clothes that we don't. We've got some personal stuff that we don't want to bring on the boat but that we don't want to get rid of in, in right. case we ever go and live somewhere else again. We'll probably find we go back to the storage in a number of years and throw everything away but yeah. that's the way life goes. Yeah. <laughs> but And with regards to living on the boat, yeah, no, it's fine. Uh, it's, it's more space than you actually think. You have to be a bit conscious of each other's space. You get so, used to working around one another and, yeah. and going past spaces and climbing up to get out of your kitchen and climbing back down and climbing onto your bed. So actually how big is the boat? She's ten and a half meters, thirty-five foot, thirty-six and a half depending on where you do the measurements and onto the push the pulpit. And 3. she's three point six the beam. beam. Yeah. And one point six draft. So we don't ever want to be in water unless the and the height is how high is it? One ninety or something? One eighty five. Okay. And over here. So and I'm only one seventy eight and you're a bit shorter than yeah. me, I think. So, so that's we can fine. stand up fine, most yeah. people. I have to bow my head in the heads, but other than that, the rest yeah. of the place I can walk around.